Hello mga ka -jans. welcome to my YouTube channel. So right now I'm here at Leiden. Kasi nga, mainit, 17 degrees. At as you can see, gandang ganda ako sa sarili ko today. Kaya mag-vlog ako about Leiden. And behind me, as you can see, is the Mullen de Vac Museum. May, of course, nag-research ako. I want to make sure that I give you the right information about the Moulin de Vac Windmill Museum. So we cannot go there kasi nga because of the pandemic is closed. But still, it's operationable. Like grand pa rin siya. The Moulin de Vac also known as The Falcon. Tiyatawag din pala siya na Falcon. Hindi po si A.J. Falcon ha. Yan po ang tawag po siya na The Falcon. And it was built in 1785 so hindi ka pa pinanganak andyan na siya ayay na ay nagka crush ni Inday nangisingisi yung ano yan do single love ako do kasi <clears throat> so yan yung Molin de Vac Museum and now we are going to another windmill here the Molin de Put close to the Rembrandt Bridge <laughs> and dito naman yung bridge na to so you can see ta -da! this is the Rembrandt bridge and it is named after the famous painter here in the Netherlands Rembrandt van Rij and ito hindi na to siya original na bridge because it was destroyed the same spot lang din I replica na lang siya but it's so beautiful that is all in the put and this is the Rembrandt Bridge. So this is Hortus Botanicus and I haven't been here but it says there na it's a must to visit here in Blayden. And of course, my pa information tayo. The Hortus Botanicus of Blayden is the oldest botanical garden of the Netherlands and one of the oldest in the world. It's open for the public but right now since COVID so we cannot go inside. Pero may nanamaligya sila. Kita dito. Nanamaligya na sila. Tulip. Okay, so this botanical garden was founded in 1590. So hindi ka pa rin buhay. Andito na siya. With a tropical glass house. Now, I will show you. listen to your tour guide okay so as you can see behind me is the old observatory it is the historical observatory that has housed the Latin astronomers for over a century isn't it amazing okay so the construction of the building marked the beginning of a flourishing period of Dutch astronomy and in the years <laughs> so, wala jeep ko so ko sa ngato ang kwan karano din sa serio. Wag po ko sa ngong gua po is ko oy. Okay, students, let's go back. 
for more information about the World Observatory, please Google yourself. <laughs> oh, mag pag Google jud mo ha. Kamo na Google ha. Oh my goodness. Wow, wala na sa akin sarili. <laughs> tayo na, may lami pa tayong puntahan. Okay, anyway, we are here at the Rappenburg Street and of all the latest streets and canals, it is the most beautiful and the oldest streets here in Lega. So, for more information about the Rappenburg Street here in Leiden, please go kill yourself. Building behind me is St. Peter's Kirk. So, this St. Peter's Kirk is. <laughs> so, the Peter's Kirk is a late Gothic Dutch Protestant church, according to tradition, founded in 1121, dedicated to St. Peter and Paul. Ooh, interesting. Isn't it? <laughs> it is known as the Church of the Pilgrim Fathers, where the pastor John Robinson was buried. Here? Tito Shabinari? It is also the burial place of the scientist Willie Brold Snellius. But anyway, that is the Saint Peter. 